If God wrote down a list of things that bothered him about us and then wrote a list of things he loves about us, which list do you think will be longer? If I'm being honest, a lot of days I'd probably think God's list of negative things about me would be extremely long. The truth is we often attribute God's thoughts about us in telling a whole lot of negative things. But I want you to hear what David said about God's thoughts towards him. How precious are your thoughts about me, O oh God? They cannot be numbered. I can't even count them. They outnumber the grains of sand. And when I wake up, you are still with me. Have you ever considered that God's thoughts towards you are precious? In fact, let me take it a step further and unpack that word. That word precious actually translates as esteemed and highly valued. God's thoughts towards you and I aren't just good thoughts. They are thoughts of esteem and value. And those highly esteemed and valuable thoughts outnumber the grains of sand. You see, I don't know about you, but I need to hear that today. If you're anything like me, you could believe some pretty negative things about yourself. Today, I want all of us, myself included, to be reminded of not other people's thoughts towards us, not to be even reminded of our own thoughts about us. I want us to be reminded of God's precious thoughts towards us. If he were to write a list of all the great things he thinks about us, that list would outnumber the grains of sand in the entire world. If you believe that, type amen in the comment section below.